everybody, we are back. You know, my next guest for playing Will Ferrell's love interest in the movie Elf, and starting Friday, she'll be seen in the new movie, The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Please welcome Zoe de Chanel. <laughs> I got the handshake, he gets the kiss. <laughs> no, I'm sorry, I just had to creep ladies out right up front. You two have worked together before, yeah, haven't you? Yeah, we worked together, um, and he's awesome. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> when you get to know me, <laughs> be a whole new universe. Now, uh, you know, I want to ask you something, because I think possibly three times, I, I fly around a lot on, mm -hmm. uh, on different flights, and, and I think three different times, <laughs> I just fly around the world constantly. <laughs> Uh, monitoring airline quality, but <laughs> but I think a couple of times, uh, easily three times, I've seen kids watching like Elf, really? you know, on on DVD or something on like a computer, and I realize that that's a movie that just gets watched over and yeah. over and over again. Yeah, is that is that weird? You must have. I mean, kids just you know, kids they, and parents yeah. have seen kids, it so many times. Yeah, kids like it a lot. I I've only seen it once. Isn't that weird? Myself. You really only saw it once. Yeah, well, I think it would be weird if I was just, like, watching myself all the time. Again, I disagree. <laughs> <laughs> if it was me, I'd be like, let's watch me some more. <laughs> but that's me, yeah. So, so you, when did you see it? You just saw it, like, at the... I just saw it at the premiere, actually. Really? <laughs> yeah, and I missed, like, my whole part, too. Like, I have, like, one little, like, moment uh -huh. in the movie, really. <laughs> and I came back, and I missed the whole thing. Where did you go? Was, like, you, you were great. You wandered off during your part? Well, I had to go to the bathroom. So. Oh, well, okay. That's, that's understandable. Hey. <laughs> but that's really, you know. You should check it out. You're very yeah. good in the movie. Oh, thank yeah. You. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, it's, you're, you're, uh, you're, you're from Los Angeles. Yeah. And I don't know, I am you know, just grew up, you know, here on the East Coast. Where, where uh, right outside uh, Boston, oh, in really? Brookline. And what I didn't... No one I knew. I didn't know anybody who was connected to show business. Oh, but really? when you grow up in L.A., yeah. I've heard that sort of everybody's in show business or connected to show business from yeah. the time that they're like five years old. Is that true? A lot of kids want to be actors in L.A., I would say. And, like, they have these, like, headshots. Like, mm -hmm. have you ever seen, like, children's headshots? Oh, yeah. They're, like... Four shots. <laughs> that's that sounded really creepy, it's by the way. <laughs> no, I, I just looked through children's headshots all day long until no, the someone, police come. Someone sent me a headshot of this kid who was like a mini me. They're like, look, it's baby John Riley. <laughs> <laughs> that's great. That's so he can play funny. young you. Did he have like four, like, because the thing that cracks me up about kids' headshots is like, and sometimes character actors have, right. have this too. It's like, they're like four. They try to like get the like sort of range of their like like they emotions show, like, and yeah, like, they so show it's the... like like sad and then there's like nerdy and right. then there's like hit the violin and serious and then there's like kid with a sideways baseball hat. <laughs> they do this thing where they'll have a regular headshot mm -hmm. on the front and then you turn it over and it's divided into different yeah, squares yeah, yeah. and it's like to show you that they can play different oh, characters. Yeah. But yeah, I get that. We get that from adults, like people oh, that want to do character parts in the show. Oh. And the front will be a guy just looking like this normally. Or like spinning around like right, that. Right, yeah, looking all sexy. <laughs> just really, you know, a 65-year-old guy going, hey. <laughs> but then you turn it over, and it's like, I can also play an old coal miner. <laughs> I have these golden in my ears. Or I can play a sailor. All aboard, chief. You know, and it's, yeah. you think, like, it just looks like they're off their medication it's or something. It's really weird. <laughs> Very sad. <laughs> Now, uh, you're, you're in this movie, The Hitchhiker's Guide yes. to the Galaxy, yeah. which I think has been long. A lot of people are eagerly awaiting this movie. I know, I'm excited about it. And it feels like, I mean, the book's been around for so long, and people have been yeah. waiting for this movie, and they, yeah. they finally made it. And you shot the movie in, in, in Bri London. In Britain, yeah. London. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Whenever I'm over there, every, I mean, I think of the United States as being sort of celebrity obsessed. Yeah. But over it's, there, they have like every single magazine in London is yeah. about celebrities. It's true. But all about their celebrities. Weird celebrities. And you flip through these magazines, <laughs> and you have no idea who these people are. I know. It was really shocking because I thought that they would be like, you know, sorry, my dress. What are you doing, by the way? Are you trying to get undressed? <laughs> I can do that game no. too. Huh? <laughs> You're like, it's very distracting. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's meant to be off Is the this shoulder. doing anything for you right here? <laughs> yeah? It's meant to be it's meant to be like this. It looks nice. They like it. Yeah. Um, <laughs> um, yeah. I haven't told you about these people yet. <laughs> very untrustworthy. Um, yeah, Max Weinberg invited me. I don't know how I ended up here. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, um... <laughs> He's a pervert. Uh, <laughs> um, 
So yeah, they've got like weird celebrities that we've never heard of over right. here. Like in, in in Britain, they're like like these strange like they all have children's names. Like they all like the are adults. called like Bitsy and Gemma and Emma and right, right, and like. Tommy and Teeny right. and like they have crazy names and you're like why am I reading a magazine that sounds like it's about I still read babies. them but it's like you know <laughs> you know Goo Goo and Bibby make the scene and it's these two people you know holding hands yeah. and you're supposed to just be flipped out about it but I don't and, know who they are yeah and even if you have a regular name like they'll make your name into something like weird that sounds like a child's name like if you were like a big celebrity in England not that you're not I'm sure you are. <laughs> That was scary for a second. I'm huge like, in Norway. Huge. You'd be like, you'd be like cones. Yeah, so if cones, you like we're hanging right. out with Madonna, it'd be like cones and Madge hit the. They call her Madge. Today. Yeah, they call her Madge. Right, right. For some reason. I want to be cones here in America. I think that would be cool. <laughs> Maybe I'm working on that. Be. Well, we have a clip here from Hitchhiker's oh, yeah. uh, uh, Guide to the Galaxy. Yeah. Anything we need to know to set this, this up? This is when um, Sam Rockwell, who plays Zaphod Beeblebrox, the president of the galaxy, <laughs> we're, we're on a spaceship and we picked up some hitchhikers um, and we didn't mean to. Okay. And Let's take a look at this clip. clip. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. What'd you, I was just watching myself. The computer says What's we have a couple of hitchhikers in our receiving bay. Hitchhikers? Why don't you pick up Hitchhiker? When we engage the improbability drive, this, the big button? Yeah, I they know. They were picked up here in sector mm -hmm. ZZ9 plural Z alpha. That's impossible. No, just very improbable. Listen, Sam, I don't have time for this, you know? We got the police of half the galaxy after us. We stopped to pick up Hitchhikers. Okay, so 10 out of 10 for style, but minus several million for good thinking. You're too gorgeous, baby. Stop it. You're driving me crazy. <laughs> Yeah. The sci-fi, the sci-fi nerds will be all over you now. Different. You said something different every time we did that scene. I was like, uh, I, so I wasn't knowing what to expect ever. Just to freak you out. Yeah. That's what a good actor does. Yeah. Freak out the person they're working with. <laughs> the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy opens in theaters uh, tomorrow. Uh, Zoe, thanks so much for being Thank here. Thank you. Cool to have you on the show. Yeah. Zoe Deschanel, everybody. We're right back. Todd Rundgren, Joe Jackson. You don't want to miss out.